Okay, so now here is part two of my collection, which is going to be the villains from my comic shelf. Up top, I have my scrolls, which consist of Scroll Queen custom, Scroll Electra, custom Pybok back there, Super Scroll. I have four Scroll Army Men, and then I have two more Super Scrolls in the back, and then two Giant Men Super Scrolls in the very, very back. Next to them, I have Thanos and his Lady Death. Next to them, I have my Broad Hive with the Broad Queen, and then four Broad uh, Drones. Then I have a Nihilus Build-A-Figure, Terax Build-A-Figure, Galactus Build-A-Figure, and then Pre-Marvel Legends Nova. And then my Fin Fang Foom Build-A-Figure. Then over here, I have my Sinister Six, uh, Vulture, Modified, Electro, Sandman, Craven the Hunter, Doc Ock, and Mysterio, who's been modified, and you can see his head back there. Underneath them, I have Latveria, and I hope to add Lucia von Vardis here soon, a custom of her. Um, my m movie video game Doombots and then I have four Doombot customs and let me open this right quick to show this off all of my Doombots have Terminator faces that I got from uh, Black Arachnus. I don't think he's doing services anymore. Maybe he is. I don't know. And then my actual Doctor Doom is sitting on the Marvel Select Doctor Doom base. Underneath them, I have all of my goblins. Hobgoblin, Roderick Kinsley. Hobgoblin, Ned Leeds. Green Goblin, Ben Urich. Green Goblin, Norman Osborn, Green Goblin, Harry Osborn, and then this one is sitting in for Gabriel Osborn. I'm eventually going to paint it gray, probably. And then my Demo Goblin and Mad Jack. <coughs> Underneath them, I have my Frightful Four, Dragon Man, Custom Wizard, Inhuman Torch, and Hydro Man. Underneath them, I have my Spider-Man villains based on animals. Man-Wolf, Beetle, Custom Owl, Scorpion, Rhino, Custom Chameleon. I have the Cyber Spider-Man, who's my stand-in for the Spider-Slayer. Behind him is a modified Tarantula. You can barely see him. Lizard and Black Cat. He's one of my favorite sculpts. Underneath them, I have my other Spider Man villains, the Symbiotes, with Anti Venom in the back. And then this Venom is representing my Flash Thompson right now. Toxin, Bride of Venom, Carnage, and then this one is supposed to represent. Uh, Angel, uh, Angel as Venom. Then I have Custom Spot, Shocker, Morbius, my Gwen Stacy from Marvel Select, and then I have three goons. I have two webbed up back here, and then I have another one behind Spot right there. Next I have Subterranea which consists of Mole Man, Giganto, and then four Moloids made out of Gollum and Schmeagle. And I painted them to glow in the dark. Actually, my cousin Ashley painted them to glow in the dark. Back up top, we have pretty much the four spaces for X-Men villains. I have Onslaught and then my Brotherhood of Mutants. Pyro, Custom Mystique, 
Sabretooth, Magneto, Blob, who's from Lubbock, Avalanche, and Marvel Select Juggernaut, who I really like, by the way. And then my Custom Toad. Then we have my Sentinels, which consist of two Build-A-Figure Sentinels, two Marvel Universe Sentinels, two X-Men Classics Sentinels, and then the bases that came with Magneto and Colossus and Sabretooth and Juggernaut. I'm sorry, Sabretooth and Gambit. Uh, filling out the rest. There's the legs and arms all the way around. And then two Wild Sentinels that came with Wolverine from X-Men Classics. Next we have my Apocalypse figures with Apocalypse, Age of Apocalypse Sunfire, Mr. Sinister, and Holocaust. Then right here I have the rest of my X-Men villains. Custom Black Queen, Omega Red, Dakin, Danger, Mojo, Spiral, and then my Senator Kelly. I have two of him. One here and then one in my movie shelf. And then I have four of these Wolverine bases which make up for my four Hellfire Club guards. And there's two right here and then there's another two behind Omega Red and Dakin. Next I have my crime related people. Uh, that's my custom stilt man in the back. And then my custom Mr. Fish with his partner or sidekick strike. Typhoid Mary, Jigsaw, Bullseye, Kingpin. Four custom goons that I made. Custom hood that I made. And Rose and Tombstone. And that makes up my crime characters. Next I have the hand ninjas, four red hand ninjas and then two chase ninjas with Lady Deathstrike, modif uh, modified Lady Deathstrike and Ogun who came with a Wolverine. And all of my hand ninjas feature weapons from the Ninja uh, that the Ninja Turtles use. Bow staff, swords, size, and nunchucks with modified chains. Underneath them I have Hydra with my Arnim Zola who has a real working screen. He's turned off right now. And behind him Crossbones in front, Red Skull, and then four Hydra agents, Baron Von Strucker, Madam Hydra, and then my Viper Custom, who I'm probably going to turn into Lucia Von Bardas. Right here, I have my Masters of Evil. In the very, very back, I have uh, King the Conqueror. In front of him is Baron Zemo. In front of him is Egghead. Behind him is Nitro, both of those customs. Claw, Constrictor, Modified... Taskmaster, who's one of my favorite Avengers villains. And then my Wrecking Crew, Pile Driver, Thunderball, Bulldozer, and the Leader Wrecker. And then I also have two of these Venom bases that have uh, Vault Guardsmen built in. Underneath them, I have my Iron Man villains which consists of Mandarin with a modified robe that's cloth and rubber, Crimson Dynamo, four Crimson Dynamos from Armored Adventures as my sort of army men for him. I have a custom Crimson Dynamo in the back and then Backlash, Whiplash, the BDSM couple from Iron Man and then a more original Whiplash right here. And then in front of him is Madame Mask and Modoc. And then back here I have a repainted movie, Ironmonger, um, until I 
modify him to look more comic accurate. Right here I have my Hulk villains, which consist of, in the back, Red Hulk, Wendigo, and Abomination. In front of Abomination is Absorbing Man, who's been modified. And then I have Leader, and then I have the UFOs right here, which consist of Vapor, X-Ray, Vector, and Ironclad. And these three, of course, are Customs. And then by Beast. Underneath my Iron Man villains, I have an entire shelf of Titanium Man characters with my Mecha Hulks. And I have four Titanium Men from the Iron Man movie line. Titanium Man himself, and then a custom Titanium Man who I just kept on the shelf. And then Gremlin right there. Next to them, I have my Ultrons which consists of four Marvel Legends 11 Ultron figures as my army versions, the Vault pre-Marvel Legends Ultron, and then a custom Ultron. And I really can't wait to add the Marvel Select Ultron to this shelf. I also have kind of decorated throughout the shelf uh, broken up Ultron bodies from an Iron Man base display. Down here I have my Underworld figures, or I guess sort of my Ghost Rider and scary characters. Nightmare custom, Orb custom. Back in the back is Scarecrow, and then in front of him is Vengeance. And then right here I have Blackheart, my custom Dormammu, who I'm really proud of and then Mephisto, and he's sitting on his throne. And then down here, I have my monster figures. Um, and most of these were in a box set. Frankenstein, Zombie, Werewolf by Night, and Dracula, and then my custom Shumagorath. Finally, I have Asgard, which consists of two frost giants from Marvel Universe. And then below them, I have Loki and the Destroyer armor. And that wraps up my... Marvel Comics display through and through. My next video will be over my Sonic action figures.